All right, question number 14. I'm going to remove the brackets. And when I do, this negative is going to come in and change all the signs of this bracket. Okay, so let me just rewrite all that. So that's equal to 8x to the power of 3y plus 11x squared y squared minus xy to the power of 3. So this negative comes in and it's going to change everything. So we're going to get, okay, the negative comes in, changes this one to a positive. So we get plus 3x to the power of 3y changes the negative 9. Okay, comes in, changes that one to a positive, comes in, changes the negative 9 to a positive. So plus 9x squared y squared and changes this positive. So the negative comes in, changes that positive to the opposite, to a negative. So minus 6xy to the power of 3. Okay, so it's time to add the like terms. Okay, so the x, the x to the power of 3y's. All right, first, so I have 8x to the power of 3y plus 3x to the power of 3y, and that makes 11x to the power of 3y. Okay, next one. Um, I have my x squared, y squared, so don't forget to take the sign. Okay, so I have plus 11 plus 9 is plus 20. Plus 20 x squared y squared. All right, and the final one. Okay, minus x y to the power of 3 minus 6 x y to the power of 3. All right, so I have minus 1 minus 6 is minus 7. So minus 7 x y to the power of 3. All right, and that is it for question number 14. Have a good day.